Have you ever watched a movie late at night on the SBS and felt disturbed by it or uncomfortable or creeped out? Because the late night movies on SBS are often the more experimental and unusual ones, unorthodox ones, that don't follow the standard narrative structure of beginning, middle and end. So they actually play around with the whole idea of how a story is meant to be told, often means that you don't actually have a beginning, a, a beginning proper. You often don't get a satisfying ending where you understand everything that's happened and who did what to who. And often you just feel unfulfilled and unsatisfied by the way that things end. And it be, it's, an interest, it's, an, it's an interesting emotional experience to actually go through a movie and your understanding of what is supposed to happen, your expectations of how a story is meant to be told are subverted and you, you feel this feeling in your head like that this isn't right because humans are such storytelling creatures that when something isn't a story being told we don't know what to make of it. Well, I watched a movie called The Lipstick Camera and it was about a porn studio where the main character placed a who was the main character who was a very familiar with photography and filmmaking was given a lipstick camera which means exactly what it means in the name. It's a camera the size of a lipstick container. And she was able to place it secretly in a room, and then, unbeknownst to her, she had caught footage of the studio manager murdering a woman, and then the police were called, and there was this fighting at the end, and it's an unsatisfying ending because, in the end, the manager, he doesn't get arrested, but he doesn't also get, doesn't get away. He sort of kinds of escapes by pretending to be, by picking up a camera that's on the ground and pretending to be one of the journalists as the police arrive. And so you don't, you're never actually sure if he's able to get away. And so the murder, just as far as the movie is concerned, and telling this story, it remains unsolved, and you just don't know what happens at the end, you don't know what happens to the main character, you just don't know what happens, and it felt really weird watching that movie. I, I can't remember a movie like that before that I've watched by myself and had no one to talk to about what this means.